This is a Photoshop tutorial in 30 seconds or so, brought to you by tutvid.com. So everyone out there today has retina devices or devices that have that high retina resolution, whatever term you want to use. And one of the newest features in Photoshop CC with the latest update is under the file menu here, export, export as, where we can now export automatically multiple file sizes of the same file. So I have my 1x normal sized file, hit the little plus icon, I can choose to export a 2x file size, it's going to go at 2x. Also note, if you're working with the largest file size, you can always export a 0.5x and maybe that's like your normal size and your, your larger size then becomes your 2x size. But let's just stick with something that's a little simpler here. We can export a 2x and if you're working with the iPhone 6 Plus or the later to be announced larger iPhones and larger Android devices, you can even go up to, you got it, a 3x image for all of your retina image needs right here from Photoshop. Hit the export all button, choose where to save your file, boom, hit the export button and it's gonna export one, two, three images in rapid succession, just like that, so you can do whatever you want. You don't want one of the images, hit the little garbage can icon, and it just gets rid of it like that. So that is how you export images for retina displays from Photoshop. It's built in. It's so easy to do now. There's really no excuse not to do it, especially if you're not the one coding it. So that's it. Get it? Got it. Good. Nathaniel Dodson, tutvid.com. I'll catch you in the next one.